Hey guys, welcome back to yet another interesting video based on BI. So in today's video, we'll be seeing how we can develop a DSS that is a decision support system or what are the different phases in making a DSS. So there are around six different phases for making a DSS. So let's have an overview of what are these six phases. And so for remembering purpose, I've made this keyword that is RPA DID that is requirement then planning analysis design implementation and finally you have to deliver the product or deliver the DSS system. So uh, it's like first you have the requirement so in that you gather all the scope of the project the number of resources that is required for your uh, working of the project the work estimation as well as the model construction cost of each of the modules different different departments are analyzed and estimated in this uh, that is at the very first that is requirement gathering or the number of weeks or the number of uh, days or the plans are laid out for completing that particular activity or task then after that you have the planning so planning is very much required like we have saw in the bi also in development of bi phases planning is required in each and every phase in development kind of activities so we understand the needs and requirement opportunities sometimes characterized by weak signals like where are all the weak points or what all are the errors that might be occurring or uh, what are the possibilities that it might go down so those weak signals are being identified in this and they are just improvised over a period of time so uh, it involves feasibility study to answers the question like why you need to actually develop a DSS for your application or for your organization next the definition of all the activities tasks responsibilities and development phases are carried or covered in this next we move on to the analysis that is we have to analyze all those things or all those requirements so uh, the detailed functions of the dss has to be developed in this so you have to develop each of the models or the functions with specific details or specific importance so uh, it answers the question what should the dss accomplish after its development and who will use it and how they are going to use it so these all questions it needs to be answered while analysis so obviously the knowledge workers may be questioning these kind of things and then uh, the uh, particular organization or the third party, uh, party developing the DSA should have to answer it. Then you have the design so it answers the question how the DSS will work so in that you need to have the hardware architecture the network the security and all those things so identification of all the hardware technology platforms network structure software tools to develop applications and specific databases that needs to be used or to be upgraded has to be dealt with this phase then it defines the interactions with the users by means of input mask then graphical visualizations on screen and printed reports all the kind of output analysis techniques graphical interfaces and all those kind of things you would define in this next we have the implementation phase like after you do all the requirement analysis gathering then all those kind of things design what you do actually implement on a one particular data or one particular uh, tenure so like after the specification is done implementation and testing and all other activities are carried along with the installation so DSS is rolled out to put out to work then later and it focuses on any change management any kind of regression or any kind of uh, version changes or version specific activities or that's carried out after any week or subsequent weeks has to be carried out so that all thing is dealt in this phase then finally you come to the delivery phase like after the test of the system then it's released for the delivery of the final product for its usage so it will be like any kind of maintenance activity or any errors that might occur in that uh, are just uncovered and it's uh, put forth in the team for like its resolution so well that was all about regarding the development phases of a dss so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you got educated by watching this video please do like share comment and most importantly don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you very much